you'd have to ask Muhyiddin what the different key pattern names for her C were. Okay. I think this is a good place to stop and let's talk. Storytellers should have a vision or perception. My question is this. How do you select characters in your stories? Okay, a very good question. Are you an, are you an aspiring writer? Um, are you? How do you select characters in your stories? Are you, I'll tell you, but are, are you also a writer? Are you trying to write? I'm asking you if you are an aspiring writer yourself. Yes. Okay, then let me tell you how to select characters in a story. Um, um, actually, characters, of, you can sit. Character, character, what's your name? Taishi. Uh, characters are most, I think characters are the most important part of a story. There are other writers who say, say put things differently. Because my own search is always for um, the idea of the human being in whatever form it takes. Even if, you, even if you turn a chair into a character, at the heart of it is the question of, um, uh, because, because we're human beings, even if you write a chair as a character and make the, give the chair a voice, um, ultimately you're projecting the whole question around your own humanity. How do you create characters in a story? From everything around you, okay? You pay attention to people, watch people very carefully. Sometimes I go into places I shouldn't go to and just sit as if I'm a part of them just to eavesdrop on their conversations, right? Writers tend to be shameless that way, right? Because sometimes you need to hear their special voice. Uh, sometimes I struggle when I'm writing a new story. I, I can't really begin a story until I can hear the characters speak to me, right? Um, so, um, it's just, just use, your, use your eyes, use your attention, listen to people around you, um, a, a lot of imagination. Um, the teacher you dislike, uh, you, you, as, as, a, as a young writer, you don't need to get angry with the teacher. Um, you, you, don't get, you, you, uh, you don't get angry, get even. So, you turn, you, that's where you create your, character, your villains. Yeah? Your villains give them your teacher, the, 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 the people that you dislike, their voices and things like that. Right? Where do you get characters from a story? From everybody around you and from everything around you, right? Okay. Does that answer your question? Good, yeah.